There's a bonus to running a star wedge or a four-way, single-way, six-way. It's this right here. There's hardly any scrap underneath this thing. Um, there's a little bit, but we got almost a face cord here. Um, for comparison's sake, when we ran those other rounds through the uh, box wedge, I got all said and done. We had five totes. This is the pile of scrap. Uh, yeah, there's some there's some pieces still in here, but this is two feet high, eight by eight. Um, there's two heaping bobcat bucket loads in this thing, or skid loader buckets. So there's still some decent stuff in here, probably. I haven't picked through all of it, so that's a good piece. Oh, that's a good piece. You know, that's a little skinny. Here's another one. That's all right. Yeah, maybe that's okay. But there's all kinds of this. So, still need to sort through this pile, but you can kind of see there's a few, few nicer pieces in here. Um, when we use it for mulch, I'll spread it out and get it kind of one layer thin, and that'll make a big difference, I think, so. This is the other project for that single knife. Um, I don't think that stuff's gonna run through the four-way terribly nice. Uh, there's a couple big pieces in there. That's the limb wood off of that, those maple stems that we were running through the box wedge, so. But that might just sit there and dry for six months or so. Maybe even next, we'll wait till next spring and then cut, split, and sell it, so. Still got this pile of ash sitting here. This has been aging out here. It's probably been here a year and a half or so. These are the ash logs that we're gonna run through the 12 way. So they're pretty straight. Uh, should run through pretty nice, I'm hoping. There's our 12 way, our box wedge. This is our little pile of double barrels. Down here next to the slash, we got got a few oak logs, a lot of ash, a lot of miscellaneous size stuff. Here's a here's that other big piece of maple, and then another one over by the by the bucket here. So we're paring this down. We just got to spend a little more time out here. Would not be possible without this wolf ridge though. And it'd be possible, but it would take a long time. Hey folks, thanks for tuning in to Around the Yard. Have a great day.